what is Via Hayosa all about? Let's find out! They have many beaches, uh, beautiful beaches, different beaches. Para vivir es muy tranquila y la gente es muy simpática y agradable. Villa Joyosa es maravillosa. I really, you feel home when you are here. Totally. Yeah. The local people are crazy here about Indian food. <laughs> Welcome to Costa Blanca, where we find Via Hayosa between Valencia and Alicante. Via Hayosa literally means joyful town, and perhaps it's because of all those beautiful, colorful buildings we can see here. And in fact, the locals call it La Vila, and La Vila has three kilometers of sandy beaches with those beautiful, colorful buildings lined along the coast and they were done in such a way so that the sailors could spot them from the sea when they were coming back. Via Hayosa is very popular with tourists and also internationals that actually chose it to live here. Let's visit some business owners in Via Hayosa. Tell me about Le Cabanon. Le Cabanon started in 96. Actually, it was a small house in front of the, the sea. Each small village was with one cabanon. That's why we have put this name that it's typical in the southwest of France. Uh, it's not especially French food, like people are thinking, or we are more actually Spanish food. Uh, we want to say that the middle of Spain to the north is what uh, actually in a lot of cards on a lot of menu you see what we prefer. We prefer to stay with Mediterranean food. We try to have the good product. Well, everything not, fresh, uh, yeah. fresh products, That's fresh fish. vegetables. Actually, we buy everything, right. nothing arrives, maybe no. only 1% of the product because it's not possible to find in market. What is so special about Villa Hayosa? It is a Spanish living town. It's a, with the fishing and the chocolate and the people uh, to live here, you have to go inside the Spanish culture. It's an open town, friendly, and it's a wonderful place to live and work. Yes. Uh, really, you feel home when you are here. Totally. Yeah. Before 86, it was the beach was only stone. Big so, stone. Big stone. And uh, from 86, they decided to make a beach really it's beautiful. Make a port. And for the, the port. A port. It's a lot of families arrive far away for use this beach. And uh, they actually arrive some from Altea uh, or from before Santa Paula who come here to use the beach. Because it's not too but, much people no. till they arrive to find and a place, even in summertime. And even in July, yeah, in yeah, July yeah, and yeah, August, yeah. You, it's not crowded. For the moment, it's, yeah, it's people, we are lucky. But it's not crowded. And the people enjoy because everyone say, all our clients say, when they come to Villa Hayosa, they feel that they can relax. They can take down the shoulders and they just, because they feel the harmony inside this old town. And I think that's, that's also because of these beautiful houses, different colors. It's not a tourism uh, uh, machine. It's a living, living town and it's... Yes, and we love it. In Villa Riosa, and we they love come it. for Villa Riosa. Yes, yes. And they feel at home. I think that's the most important, that you feel at home in Villa Riosa. Chiringuito Nuevo Varadero. What have we got here? Oh, it's a great chiringuito, uh, very big. The location is beautiful. You are by the Varadero Beach? Varadero Beach. Okay. What kind of special foods do you have here? We have uh, grilled food, fish, uh, meat, uh, clams. Uh, we are the only bar here, I, I think, in all the Valencia, the coast, that we do the clams with the grill. Oh. And it tastes a little bit of, of grill. Special. Fantastic. Two other 
other chiringuitos you have, yes? Yeah, I have two other chiringuitos here in Villa Joyosa too. That one is in the Bolno Beach. Last year was the second most beautiful beach in Alicante. Over there we make grill too, um, cocktails and what is mean in a chiringuito but a little chiringuito, mm -hmm. a okay. chiringuito beach bar. And then it's the sunset, yes? This is sunset. The sunset chiringuito is in Las Puntas del Moro. The sunset over there is Spectacular. amazing, <laughs> amazing, yeah. I choose Villa Joyosa like a town for my business because they have many beaches, uh, beautiful beaches, different beaches. You have a stone, you have sand, you have little, you have big ones. Anil, Indian restaurant here in Via Hayosa, what inspired you to open here? Well, there's two things that inspired me. First of all, it was my wife, who is sadly, she's not with me. She had a dream of, and I had a passion of Indian food. And we came to Spain in 2002, 3, looking for a place after she had the big C, the cancer. This is the only place we found, which was next to the beachfront. We traveled all the way from Malaga, going up to Denia, but we couldn't find a good location like this. And it's original Indian restaurant. Uh, we've been to many, but this is different, eh? Yeah, my style of cooking is totally different. Though it is Indian, but see, I've got a bit of African cooking in it because my mother and father they they moved to Africa in the early 50s and in those days in Africa there was no Indian restaurants so my mom and my dad they used to cook home and she taught us how to cook as well and though they were vegetarians I've taken some of the veggies out and put meat in it and experimented and they turned out to be better meals than <laughs> than what uh, most restaurants provide. But we do have the traditional Indian restaurant theme. And why do you like this town so much? Besides character, it's, it's the people. The people are so friendly and warm, apart from one or two. <laughs> yeah, you always get that everywhere, yeah. But uh, in the end, I've managed to integrate with the whole town and everybody now knows me and respects me and I give my respect back to them as well and in the beginning it was the English and most of the northern European that used to come and eat now we got a lot of Spanish that we depend on we did a trial run during the recession on the beach taking food out samples giving to the Spanish trying to convince them <laughs> because they got this uh, one thing that Indian food picante that means hot so and we try to convince them that not everything is hot you can taste all the spices but not everything is hot the local people are crazy here about Indian food <laughs> Pues Galaxy es un parque de ocio con unas pistas súper grandes para que celebramos cumpleaños, fiestas tematizadas. Hacemos todo lo que puedas imaginar. ¿Y es por eh, niños de todos los años? No, tenemos eh, desde los niños desde que pueden andar y defenderse ellos por las colchonetas hasta los 10 años. Hacemos cumpleaños hasta los 10 años. Ok. ¿Y por qué Vía Joyosa es el lugar al que vivir y al que visitar? <risa> Vía Joyosa es muy bonito, es muy familiar, tiene muchísimas cosas de ocio, entre ellos para los niños, como tenemos nosotros, y hay mucha restauración, gastronomía, lo tiene las playas preciosas, lo tiene todo.
We have been here for 25 years and we continue with the same vision. It's very important for us that people see well and efficiently. Leaving fashion aside, we have a great variety of models. We have something for everybody. We help people to choose the best contact lenses for them. We offer services to help people see and hear well, all at reasonable prices. Why do you have a bar in Via Hayosa? We like this place. It's a typical Spanish place with a lot of local people. And it's also quiet. So that's the reason we are here in Via Hayosa. So I hear this is a Belgian restaurant. We offer typical Belgian foods and we make also paella. We have also Spanish people who are coming to eat the paella. Uh -huh. And the Belgian food, it's a stew, it's a typical things from Belgium. We sell also a lot of Belgian beers, very special, the Duvel, the Liffe, Quack, and also Westmau, Pauwen, Schippeler. These are all kind of Belgian beers. So very special in Villa Riosa is we have the Moros and Cristianos, and it's the last week of July, it's always the same date. And then we have especially the disembarkation, and it's also UNESCO heritage. Juan Antonio, la senarita bendiga me que es. Es un restaurante de, de especializado para el turismo y para las familias. Con lo cual, la gama de la comida, lo que ofrecemos, está enfocado a ello, a la afluencia turística, con una carta muy extensa para poder coger lo mejor de todo el mundo. También tenemos mucha carta de comida italiana, especialistas en pizzería y pasta, que hemos amoldado a nuestros nuestras recetas españolas. ¿Paella? Paella sobre todo, una especialidad que hacemos aquí, que creemos que gusta mucho. Y luego tenemos una heladería especializada con helados artesanos, de los artesanos de aquí de la zona de Alicante, se fabrican en Quijona, una ciudad que hay aquí cerca. La ubicación la vemos como privilegiada, estamos en la primera línea, junto al paseo, la playa, ya ves, a 10 metros. Y todavía tenemos las cosas buenas y bonitas que no está masificado. Pues para vivir es muy tranquila y la gente es muy simpática y agradable. ¿Qué haces aquí, María? Bueno, tenemos un salón de peluquería y un salón de belleza. Hacemos todo tipo de tratamientos, tanto para el cabello, como para la piel, como para el cuerpo. Eh, tenemos mm, tratamientos mm, hidratantes, tratamientos rejuvenecedores, tenemos tratamientos de todo tipo, queratinas para el cabello, manicuras para las manos, para los pies, depilaciones, eh, un poquito todo lo que es la estética en el cuerpo y en el cabello, todo completo. Tenemos el solarium para broncearte, ¿Por 
¿Por qué te gusta Villajoyosa? Porque Villajoyosa es maravillosa para vivir, tenemos un sol estupendo, unas playas estupendas y una gente muy agradable. Es maravilloso. To discover other towns and the people of the Costa Blanca, tune into our website at apnocostablanca.com. Step down.